Hello geocachers, it's Symbol here and um, one of my caches was uh, muddled here but um, I'm not surprised but can you see uh, if I zoom in there's lots of muggles that there's a big um, playing field there the two goalposts where they play football and there's lots of kids that come here in the summer see there that there's my point continually all the way round they keep walking round with dogs so uh, doggles walking muggle muggle the muggle is the man actually the one that doesn't know about geocaching and might uh, uh, muggle my my hidden cache and the dogs are doggles he's got three doggles walking in around for exercise i should get a couple of dogs i'm lo looking towards getting a couple of dogs when, uh, when I'm a little older. A couple of uh, sheep dogs would be good. Anyway, see my point, it was muggled because there were so many people walking around the main park here and I actually hid a camo in that tree there, which I thought was a great idea because it's in between one of my other caches down by the canal, uh, which is called uh, Kingfisher Caches Fish, which is, um, I'll show you in a minute, it looks really good uh, statue that's been carved out in this park and the other one that you might have seen in my other video uh, called lightning strike or oh, no it's called um, lightning tree I've called it lightning tree so you come up here and find the we're going to get find this one now actually but just to show you I wanted to make it easy because there's lots of doggles walking around this path here can you see the path and if I zoom in can you see a lightning tree there you are. It's hidden at the bottom of that route. So if you want to see my uh, video on that, um, uh, have a look, subscribe, and uh, have a look at my videos. I've done about, I've done quite a few videos now, and I'll be doing more for spring and summer. Now, hopefully, I'm going to find this because um, I've got my GPS to bring it, but I thought, well, I'm only looking for and checking on my geocaches. And uh, I think I call it Silver Birch. And the trouble is, I didn't realise there were so many. Oh, this is going to be tricky. I must have done it slightly different to the other, others. Oh, did I change it over? I think I was going to do Silver Birch. Because you can see there's so many. I might have changed it over. I might have changed it. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Look and search and rescue or did I change it because this this was the only fir tree and you'd always see the green and so hopefully I've hidden it here I have it's here actually first of all I was going to put it on one of these and then I decided this look there's too many a bit too many and people are walking their dog or just along this path here all around the field so they wouldn't have much chance to find it between these uh, could have put it deeper in there but why I changed it from the field is because this is a bit more quieter than the main field where they're playing football less people walk around this bit here so it's uh, less chance of getting muggled also I thought I put it in this fir which when it, all the leaves are growing and it's can you see it's harder to find and then and, when they come up, they come up, up that bank, so you'll see muggles walking up this bank here, so you can sort of hide from it. And they'll be all greenery and camouflage, and you'll be able to see them spot and come around here anyway. So you know what I mean. It was, it's a better position than the main field over there. Uh, so it was fir tree, not um, silver birch. I uh, didn't need my GPS because I spotted it. Look at that. And uh, I'm not sure what the clue was, except the title's called Silver Silver Birch. And this is in Springfield Park. I think it's Sil Silver Birch, uh, Springfield, Springfield Park. If you pull that up, oh yeah, I called it. Now it, I rem remember it's called simply Camo Cash is the clue. And the title is uh, Fern. So I've put a um, container in there to keep it doubly, doubly um, secure from the rain and nice and dry. And uh, that's just a simple um, 
just in case somebody does pull that over, I'm just going to put that over there, some leaves over, I think, because somebody might pull that and say, oh, I'd like that for my, like a step, doorstep. There you are, and that, that'll keep it dry as well. That's like a little um, roof. So you've got the roof, keep the rain coming off. You've got the container, the camo container that I've um, fixed with um, uh, camo tape and the little container inside to keep it doubly dry. And then, then once you've found that, they'll look on their GPS and look for lightning tree right that's uh, my other video hope you enjoyed that this was symbol and happy geocaching we're going to go and check on my uh one by the canal called uh kingfisher catches fish it's a beautiful structure so worth having a look if you want to have a look at that i'm going there now okay see you in a bit bye for now and happy geocaching everyone See you on the next one. Bye.